All right, everybody. I am on my first night on my own. Cheryl flew to Seattle, so it's just me. Well, not entirely just me. It's the doggies, too. You could see them. They're kind of confused. They really don't know what's going on. I mean, mommy's not here. She's been gone all day. They finally got uh, to see somebody when I got home from work. So it's been a long day for them and I'm sure they're really confused. So they've had dinner and now I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna have for dinner. But we went to Pie Five Pizza last night and we got a pizza each. So I'm gonna show you, this is what I'm gonna have for dinner tonight. It's leftovers from our pizza last night. You can see majority of Cheryl's pizza she didn't eat, which is double pepperoni, mushrooms, black olives, and then mine is chicken alfredo sauce with onions, peppers, and bacon. So that's what I'm going to have for dinner. Uh, I can tell you I miss Cheryl a lot. Um, it's going to be weird tonight by myself. And dogs are already pretty freaked out about it. So we're going to make it work. It's going to be a long couple of weeks. And I'm going to try to vlog a little bit when I get home from work. So stay tuned and you'll see what happens with me. Cheryl should be vlogging too. So you'll probably see some things that she is doing up in Seattle while she's gone. All right, you guys, I'm in Seattle. My parents' backyard. It's nice and spacious and Ryan says don't put me in the vlog. <laughs> uh. And my mom was so nice enough. She got me some Zimas. Thank you, mama. She knows what I like. And so, got here a few hours ago. We went out to dinner. We had Chinese food. And now we're just relaxing. And it's just the perfect weather. First night's dinner, we decided on Chinese. This restaurant is called Lucky Star. We had deep fried prawns, barbecued pork, barbecued pork fried rice. And I believe it was almond chicken that Ryan ordered there. All of the food was delicious. Here's some footage of Daisy. She's all excited to see me. This is our first night. And she's like, yay, somebody else is going to pet and love on me. Ryan's like, don't record me. Mom's backyard is just beautiful. And Daisy loves her mama. Here's some footage of Daisy just hanging out at the back door. Like, let me in. I'm done doing my business. But I just wanted to video record her a little bit because she's just so cute. She just sits there patiently and waits. Daisy's back home. Slow motion, running up those stairs. Yay, I'm home. And then here, I kind of fast forward it. She's kind of slow. Coming back to the door, did her business in the grass. She's so cute. My mom has a ton of bird feeders in her backyard here, but this is just one that I thought I would video record and show you all of these cute little birdies getting some yummy food. What are you doing? This is a cutie. What are you doing, huh? What are you doing? Daisy. You're so funny. Yeah. Say good morning. Oh, big yawn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you tired. We were out and about, and look at this beautiful Mount Rainier, no clouds. We had actually stopped by this bread store called Franz. But yeah, I just had to get some footage of beautiful Mount Rainier, no clouds. You can see it. It's so beautiful. My mom made reservations for all of us to have brunch at Salty's. This is the Redondo Beach location. All right, we're at brunch and this is our beautiful view. Yeah, it's so nice here on the sand. So my mom and dad and I, Ryan, we're at Salty's on the pier having a lot of fun. So we just ordered our drinks. As you can see, there's the water. We've got a beautiful view. And so now we're going to go get our yummy food. Here are some pictures of Ryan and I at brunch, our snow crab, my dad and his brunch. 
My mom got to make her own Bloody Mary and my mimosa. And just some random pictures of everything that we ate at our brunch. I completely forgot to take pictures of the buffet. So I took pictures off of Yelp. Why not? So you all could see exactly what our experience was in the buffet. Look at all that snow crab and Dungeness crab. They have melted butter at your table. They kept every single food well stocked for us. Look at that chocolate fondue and all of the desserts to choose from. Isn't that crazy? All right, you guys. I think Cheryl's about ready to tap out. I've had three platefuls of food, snow crab, potatoes, breakfast stuff, all kinds of desserts. I am stuffed. Ryan's stuffed. And uh, Mom and Dad just went back to get some uh, more treats. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm just about done. So, you guys, if you're in the Redondo Beach area, go to Salty's. It's so delicious. It's like an all-you-can-eat buffet. It's so yummy. You won't be disappointed. It's day two. And first full day all by myself, taking care of the doggies, taking care of me. So making dinner tonight. Don't have any leftovers, so I'm on my own. So I'm actually making macaroni and cheese and meatballs. So I'll show you. Right now, got the macaroni boiling. Well, it's not really boiling, it's a, a little bit, but trying to keep it uh, cooking. I've got the gravy, which uh, wish I had a smaller pan. But I'm getting the gravy going, and then I'll add the meatballs, and that will be really good. But it's gonna take a little time to get it all done and took care of the dogs got them out when i got home so they've been outside been able to go to the bathroom and they ate so that's so far what i've gotten done so so far today but um should be a good dinner it's going to take a little bit of time a little bit of effort i appreciate cheryl because she does all this stuff before i get home which makes it really nice for me to come home, just relax, have a good dinner. And now I appreciate all that she does. So that's what I'm doing tonight. Okay, so finished product. It actually didn't take too long to do it. It just seemed like it would take a long time. But here you go. Macaroni cheese and cheese and meatballs with brown gravy. Of course, need a Dos Equis. So that is what I'm gonna eat. It turned out pretty good, it smells really good. I'm super hungry. This may be one of the only meals I actually make. Uh, I'm gonna have to assess what options I have, you know, to make something quick that's not gonna be like, you know, a frozen pizza. Um, and also something that, you know, because it's only just me, so no Cheryl. So I've gotta cook something that I can do for one person. So that's gonna be the challenge, but, um, Got it made, it's all done. Great, great um, job and looking forward to actually eating it. Hi guys, it's been a couple of days so I thought I would get on here and give you all a little update. I have been having a blast with my family. Great weather here in the Seattle area. It's been like 90 plus degrees. My parents have AC inside the house, so that's a thumbs up, because not everybody has AC here. You might be hearing the wind chimes or the uh, water fountain in the background. So, um, and the neighbors are also getting their lawn mowed, but I think they moved to the front of their house. Yesterday, we just stayed home most of the day. We did a couple of errands. We went to the store and got some snacks and stuff like that. Got to take Daisy for a walk. That dog is so cute, full of energy and just good conversation. We went out to dinner last night to the Ram Brewery restaurant and all of our food was fantastic. If you've not been to the Ram, you need to go. Good food, good service. And it's a good atmosphere in there. 
And then, um, yeah, I'm trying to still adjust to the time difference. There's a two hour time difference, so I'm definitely going to bed before everyone else. <laughs> So today we're going to be doing some packing for the beach house. Um, we leave tomorrow, so we got a lot to do. And then tonight we're going to be going out to Ivers for dinner. It's not like the Ivers restaurant, but it's like a fast food restaurant. So that's what I've been up to. All right, we're on the back porch here. Last night before we head to the beach house tomorrow, mom and dad are watering the front and back lawn. And she's got such a beautiful back porch here. It's so nice. And we made homemade margaritas. Mine is frozen. And mom's is on the rocks. Delicious. And we have a beautiful sunset here in Washington. Picture of Daisy and I. Daisy and Ryan together. My mom would always have butterflies flying around in her backyard. So lucky. We hardly see any here in Texas. Daisy, I believe, is three years old. If I'm wrong, I will caption it down below for you all. She is such a love. You guys, I hope you enjoyed part one. Stay tuned to part two of our vacation at the beach.